Hello, my name is John Ferrist and this is my personal CV or taking you through some of the things that I have been involved in and understand. I would like to take you first through to... Social media has become an important part of getting a message across. Most people will probably use Facebook or other forms of social media each day. So for us it's important to be able to boost our message and get the message across to key individuals. The slides you see on this particular video, or this video, show a series of posts that we made to a jobs fair to attract 18 to 24 year olds to actually engage within the website Benefits to Apprenticeships and the Benefits to Apprenticeship platform. The slides were promoted the images were promoted along with text to go to the jobs fair and each one was targeted directly to a jobs fair within the UK that was running on that particular day. The targets then <coughs> reached those people and we had engagement from those particular posts. In any instance of posting we aim to geographically target, we aim to reach the right age groups with the right interest that these age groups will have to the product or service we're promoting. And we look for the right image to actually attract the, those people that we want to get the message across to. The keywords are always an important part of any post or any website. Indeed, keywords are often used in YouTube under tags. So the keywords we actually research through things like Google and through Hashtagify and other key areas where social media and websites will actually relate to those words. So the images you see here connect with those particular areas. I suppose I got involved with websites between about seven and eight years ago, designing them with WordPress, Wix, and various other formats of website. HTML is an area that I have some understanding of now, as well as some of the key words. Some of the areas I have looked at include Benefits to Work, CGSS.org, and uh, Benefits to Apprenticeships, and <laughs> many of the welfare benefits.co.uk areas where people have actually expressed an interest through social media so as each page has developed on social media websites have been built accordingly uh, with images photos uh, statistics posts on a whole variety of subjects i've even run training websites with the uh, aspects of um, video tile and other resources similar to that so that's information in that particular area. Next. Behind every single website, you'll find some form of source coding. In this particular instance, the key area of source coding is Google Analytics. Why? Because this allows us to look at the traffic coming to the website where people are actually going, what they're actually interested in, their age, where they're coming from within the world, and also how long they're spending on each page. There's more information on this to come, but source code uh, is an important area behind the website and is also a key area to look at to make sure everything is going to function correctly. Google Analytics, free source of information once it's uh, inserted into your source code of the website, it provides us with a lot of information, both active use, how the post or the page is attracting people to the website and what post pages are working, as well as where people go to once they come to the page. Are they interested in buying the goods or services? Are they showing an interest in what you're actually providing? We can see real-time access. We can see how many men and women uh, are coming onto the site, if they're using a mobile, tablet or computer, and a great deal more information, time and date, uh, over a period of time, if attracting more people to the site, etc. 
So that's our Google Analytics. The welfare benefits system has always been an interest of mine since finding myself unemployed. As the welfare system has changed, my interest has developed in it. Training with the, United, with the CAB in areas like social security law as well as universal credit. And with that rollout, I have taken a keen interest looking at statistics from the DWP and the Office of National Statistics. So if that's an area that you have an interest in, I'm happy to provide information. And hopefully something may be of interest. Thank you. And uh, please make contact.